WFNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this 1st of April, Monday. We're looking at the Dow down 141 at 10 o'clock. This is the Tiger Financial News Network 10 o'clock update. And we're looking at the Dow down 142 at 39,664. Uh, you know, over the weekend, uh, when I did my uh, video for my subscribers, an hour long video, there were a lot of things. There's a real mixed market here. And we'll go through that in my show coming up, the Tiger Technicians Hour. So we've got the Dow down. Listen to this. Dow's down 142. The S&P, <laughs> this is so fascinating. The S&P is up. So here you've got the down shop, Dow down shop, and I couldn't figure out where it was. Uh, I think it's triple M. Yeah, there are a couple of stocks that are really taking it on the chin there. Um so the S&P is up four at 52,059. It hasn't taken out the 52,64.85. I need to just double check that. I believe that's the price. Yeah. Uh, on Friday, we, this is going to be very important because I think this week you're going to see a couple of conflicts where there certain stocks could really help certain indexes. But overall, I'm starting to see some weakness in quite a number of stocks. The QQQ is up 3.36. At 447.43, underneath the high that was made just over a week ago. And we're looking at the IWM, the Russell 2000, trading quite nicely um, on Friday, but now it's given back some down 68 at 209.61. It ended 211.88. Now we're looking at gold. Gold had a spectacular move um, overnight. It actually went up to 2264.4. It's trading at 2259.7, not a big deal um, in that it's given back a chunk. But look at this. This is a big move. And I, I'm I'm kind of intrigued because I was pointing out to subscribers that the gold has gone to a leg D. And it isn't often that gold and the dollar go together in the same direction. Every year there's like three three times a year for maybe two weeks, three weeks, where they go, they trend in the same direction. So um, the dollar's up 16 ticks at 104.65, holding quite nicely. Crude oil, crude oil is up uh, seven cents, making a new recovery high. Oh, bonds, getting slammed again. Bonds are down almost two points, the so yields are going high. I think this market's got some headwinds this week. Huh, we'll see, we'll talk about when we return. Basil Chapman, Tiger Conditions Hour. 